Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to a brand new video on my channel. Just rolling out. Looking pretty okay so far. We had quite a lot of rain last night. Um, river is definitely flowing. I'm just going to go to the rollout now and then onto the lift, onto stage one. So uh, yeah, keen for it. So just made the traverse all the way over to Saalbach. Um, now we're getting up to stage one. Um, I think it's called the Bergstadt Trail. Technical roti trail at the end and quite narrow and fast at the top. Um, so an interesting one. Yes, last year I rode pretty good on this one. So let's try to do the same. Okay, okay. Hello. Uh, oh, no, good. Yeah. Right, it's good. Mm -hmm. yeah. Perfect. Thank you, Zia. Ciao, ciao. Right on. Nice. Oké, okay. handen goed rusten. De tussenstukken. So, first stage out of the day is done and dusted. Um, I had some issues again with the transmission, but now I think the battery didn't make good connection or something because I tried to shift and it just didn't shift. Luckily enough for me, I was in quite a light gear, so I, I was still able to continue on but um, it wasn't amazing, let's say. And of course it it, um, it played a bit of thing in my head. So I wasn't like gonna stall or something because otherwise it would be a big problem. But all in all, pretty good. Not the greatest, I must say. Um, I don't know, just a bit messy. Tried to push at the top, it was pretty, going pretty good. And then when the derailleur stopped working, it all went a bit meh meh. Still came over the finish quite okay spa, I would say. I'm, I think, sitting seventh right now. I'll put in the screen right here what I am sitting after, like the whole stage, so a stage result. Uh, but of course, there's no more rides to come down. But all in all, it was okay, not the greatest, not the best, um, but um, could have been worse. Let's say, let's say that. Oh. Yeah, ciao. Okay.
weer door daar. Oh man. Oh my, the rocks. So while I was editing the video, I realized I didn't film after stage two. So I thought I would just make a video right now. Stage two actually went pretty well. Um, I'm pretty sure I was 21st, 21st in stage two. So that was good. Um, and I was sitting, let's see, 21st in the overall after, overall after stage two as well. Um, very good stage, um, pushed quite hard. Um, it was hard to guess because in the in the race it was very wet, even more wet than on the video you just saw. Um, so that was quite sketchy, and so it was hard to push. But um, yeah, it was super important to get a good result on that last stage. So um, back to the video. Good. Right. Yeah. Fuck. So, just finished stage three, laid it down at the end. Um, the tape was broken or something. So my, my point where I usually aim to go, um, I did it wrong because the tape was gone. So, and then I was looking at the tape for what's, what was going on. And then before I knew it, I think I hit a root and I laid it over um, and then <laughs> lost a bit of confidence still looking at the result I don't think it's that bad didn't really lose too much time or like I lost too much like I lost some time but overall I rode pretty good um, now I'm heading to the pits do a quick check on everything fuel up eat something drink something and then we're going out for stage four, five and six. Um, stage four and six are my favorite trails. So I'm pretty keen to see how that goes. Um, so I'm pretty happy with that. I'm sitting around 20, 
between 25 and 30 right now um halfway through the race so we still have three more stages to go so we'll see what happens for the for the stages to come um so yeah keen for it hello hello so on to stage four now so as you can tell there's quite a lot of lift assistant stuff here um we do however have to pedal all the way over to the other side of the mountain to Salbach um, so that's quite a distance not really height meters but quite a distance from trail to trail or like let's say from start to stage one and from stage two to stage three but um yeah not so much climbing is like finale or poland like let's say um just heading up now for stage four um this one brings me all the way up to stage four so um keen for this one more of a bike parky kind of stage so should maybe give me some benefits compared to the other stages um even though this stage is will be a the stages now will be a lot shorter than the ones we did this morning but we'll see what happens um as i said a little layover on the other stage and um yeah lost a bit of time there for sure um but it is what it is that's enduro and um i'd rather be pushing it to the limits and have a tumble um at least once in the race as long as it's not a huge one of course than uh, holding up too much and then um not being fast enough because nowadays with the enduro is so tight that you kind of have to push the limits so yes we are on on the lift right now sun is somewhat shining but it's raining on and off it was raining before stage three as well um so we rode that one as well as in the practice quite wet conditions um so yeah stage four coming up now hangman one let's see what happens <coughs> yeah perfect thank you So after stage four, I was sitting 23rd as well, uh, same as the position. So I got 23rd on that stage you just saw, um, and it was 23rd overall as well. Uh, forgot to film again, um, but this was the last time I forgot to film. All the other stages, I between the rest of the stages, I didn't remember to film. Um, so pretty solid stage, it was quite hard to put a good pace down because in the routes it was super sketchy so you had to slow down quite a lot but then on the fast bits you had to go wide open so it was an interesting one but um, very cool and uh, let's go on to the on to stage five yeah, it's on. I can see. is it oh yeah oh, yeah it's on mine too yeah. okay. okay let's go
good that one that's fun huh they put some new so stage five done that's quite a physical one to be honest pushing quite hard sprinting out of every corner but it was good stage four was good too um i forgot to film something in between but you probably have have seen some bit of me talking about that stage already um now paddling up to stage six final stage of the day not sure what i'll be sitting right now but i'll put that into the screen and uh yeah last stage of the day sun came out we'll see if it's dry or not but should be good nonetheless so let's get it last stage come on yeah So, race just finished up, um, crowd, um, it's pretty cool, they had a little live stream going on right there, um, so that's quite cool for the future of Enduro. Um, I was really hoping for top 20 here, not quite yet made it, um, I was 26 I think, um, one place shorter than last year, but all in all super cool day, and I want to give a big shout out to the guys here from the Epic Bike School, well done, Emil man. and Shurt, for uh, letting me be here already a week early to ride a bit in the bike park. Um, and of course, um, it was super cool to be with them and try, uh, try to ride a bit of different stuff here. So that was super cool. So again, if you guys wanna go and um, ride here in the bike park, Epic Bike Park with Leo Gang, check these guys out. Epic Bike School. I'll put the website right here, or um, and you can find the phone number there as well. Um, so if you want to make an appointment to ride the trails that we rode today, um, hit them up, and uh, yeah, should be uh, should be a good shout. So um, thanks, guys, again, mm -hmm. and uh, good luck for the next one. See you guys in the next one. Yo yo.